They scared Little Red Riding Hood and the three little pigs. And even though they are some of the most feared hunters in the world, they are also very loving, loyal, and playful. What are they? Hint, turn the page to find out. Answer, wolves. What is a wolf? A wolf is a kind of animal called a mammal. Many mammals have hair and feed their babies with milk. You're a mammal too. Red wolf. Ethiopian wolf. Gray wolf. Kinds of wolves. Gray. Red. Ethiopian. There are three different types of wolves in the world. The gray wolf, the red wolf, and the Ethiopian wolf. Red and Ethiopian wolves are smaller and more slender than gray wolves, and they are more rare. Wolves are related to jackals, foxes, coyotes, and dogs. But most wolves are a lot bigger than man's best friend. Wolves can weigh over 100 pounds and be over six feet long from their nose to the tip of their tail. Jackal, coyote, fox. Believe it or not, wolves are related to all dogs. What makes a wolf a wolf? Just like dogs, wolves have a tail and four legs. But wolves have legs that are much longer and stronger. They can run over 20 miles per hour. And they can run for many hours before getting tired. What big ears wolves have. They can hear sounds from up to six miles away. What a big nose a wolf has. It can pick up the scent of an animal from a mile away. Wolf body parts. Four legs, tail, big ears, over 40 sharp teeth. And what big teeth a wolf has? The better to eat with. What do wolves eat? Other animals. Wolves are carnivores, which means they eat meat. Small animals like rabbits, beavers, and mice often become a wolf snack. Sometimes wolves nibble on berries. But wolves mostly feed on larger animals, some much bigger than themselves, like deer, elk, or even moose. Can you spot the hungry, hiding wolf? Wolf food. Rabbits, beavers, and other small animals. Berries, deer, moose, and other large animals. Where do wolves live? While dogs like to live at home with you, a wolf needs to live out in the wild to be happy. A wolf is a wild animal. Dogs are domesticated animals that descended from wolves. Domesticated means they have learned to live with people. Wolves can be found in most northern parts of the world. Many live in the forests or prairies where there is plenty of food. Some wolves, like the arctic wolf, a kind of grey wolf, live on the icy cold tundra. An arctic wolf has tufts of hair between its paw pads to help it run on ice. Wolf homelands, northern regions, forests, prairies, tundra. How do wolves live? Wolves usually live together in a group called a pack. A pack may have less than six or more than 20 wolves. Members of the pack care for and protect each other. They live together as a family. 
Wolf packs are very protective of their territory, an area of land that they claim for their own. It's like a pack's neighborhood. A pack will not let other wolves into its territory. Every pack has a leader called an alpha male. The alpha male is bigger and stronger than the others. All the other wolves in the pack follow him. The alpha male's mate is called the alpha female. A wolf that lives on its own is called a lone wolf. How do wolves hunt? The whole pack hunts for food together. They chase and surround their victim. Usually one wolf grabs hold of the animal with its jaws. Then the others attack. As soon as an animal is caught, it's meal time. Wolves take turns eating, but the alpha male always eats first. How do wolves communicate? Wolf vocabulary. Howl equals, I'm over here, or get the pack together. Whimper equals, I'm unhappy. Bark equals, hey, I want your attention. Ears back equals, I'm afraid. Bad teeth equals, stay away. Head and ears up high equals, I'm the boss. Wag tail equals, I'm happy, come play. Wag tip of tail equals, I'm about to attack, so watch out. Tail between legs equals, you're the boss. Wolves also use smells to communicate. They leave their scent on trees to let other wolves know whose territory they are in. Wolf talk. Sounds. Body movements. Scents. How are wolves born? The alpha female is usually the only wolf in the pack to have babies. Wolf babies are called pups, just like baby dogs are called puppies. Before her pups are born, the mother digs a big hole in the ground called a den. Then she sits inside and waits. When the pups are born, they can barely stand. They stay close to their mother and feed on her milk. The pups are born blind and deaf. They cannot hear for three days. They can't see for the first 14 days. How do wolf pups grow up? After two weeks, the pups are ready to leave the den. But like all mammal babies, wolf pups need to be taken care of. The mother will stay very close to her pups for the first few months of their lives. All members of the pack help feed them, play with them, and eventually teach them to hunt. In six months, the pups will be almost as big as their parents. And as the pups wrestle together, they learn the way of the pack, that the biggest and strongest wolf always wins. Bet you didn't know. The first ancestors of the wolf lived more than 50 million years ago. Wolves can go without food for three or four days. A wolf's paw print can be larger than an adult human's hand. A wolf only has three enemies, other wolves, bears, and hunters. Wolves are good swimmers. A pack of howling wolves can be heard from 10 miles away. A wolf's jaws are strong enough to crush bones. Next time you take your dog for a walk, remember... There's a little wolf inside him! <laughs>